welcome or welcome back today i'm going to be showing you guys as well as give you tips on how to complete this week's master root of nightmare challenge called the illuminated torment challenge short and sweet you need to kill the tormentors with a field of light buff as you can see in the footage me myself i pretty much stay around the buff as well as there is another person for the first two you should just need two people just to be able to kill the tormentors but the other people who don't have the buff they pretty much add clear as well as get the tormentor down as much as possible on the first two i believe we were able to save it i know for sure on the first one um as we ran it a few times you can end up saving the first first tormentor to the second um part but in my opinion i think you should just kill them as soon as you can just to you know you don't have any <laughs> any lingering tormentors or anything like that as you progress further on into this encounter you you will need more people to get that field of light buff to watch the tormentors because on that third part it's kind of hard for somebody if the buff is on the right and the tormentor spawns on the left it's really hard for one person to run all the way over and kill him so on that third part you will need multiple people because i believe there's like three tormentors that end up spawning in that last part uh, i believe left right and top or they kind of can alternate or mix up it doesn't matter but you will need multiple people on that third part and all you have to do is pretty much repeat how you did the first one have people clear ads as soon as those torments come up people get them down and make sure the guys with the field of light buff finish them it does get hectic in that third part and we did mess up a few times just because bullets flying everywhere supers going um aoe damage going everywhere and we did have to end up wiping a few times just because maybe somebody's grenade or maybe like a melee strand end up hitting the tormentor but that's all you have to do and you do end up getting your chest as you can see at the end i will be showing the weapon that i got i did get a sidearm it's decent of course i'm looking for the ar adept but there you guys have it i hope you found this helpful if you did hit that thumbs up button as well as comment down below what was your method on completing this challenge and as always thank y'all so much for watching and i will see you in the next one Oh,